definitely not what we were after. We kind of had a pretty good start off the line, then we couldn't hold our lane on board. Don't know. Not sure. Not, not sure what happened. We were slow on port for a long time. Yeah, we had a bit of a speed issue. Yeah. Yeah, we we're going up winds and yeah, it seemed to lack that 0 0.1, 0 0.2 of a knot. You know, so we're giving each other a little bit of heat, but uh, yeah. We're opening it up for a huge force. Yeah, there was a lot of bad noise in there. It's closed, but there's something in it. Looks like I'm going over the side. I'm just going to have to get a lot of heel on. Oh, I'll go over and rip it off. Pretty good night. Uh, we found a connection again with uh, with the fleet, which is good. So uh, actually, in the last cat, we went from uh, zero to hero. We were uh, even at a very close, but at least we were the first in the position report. So that's good. And uh, yeah, it's close racing now. A oh, bit of luck, really. But um, guys have been sailing pretty hard all night. Everyone's been up pretty much most of the night. Jived on a couple of shifts. And then we got a, a nice header for a while, just set ourselves up to lure to the fleet and that worked out there and then jived immediately back on the next shift, so um, it's all pretty close. I mean everyone's compacted the whole fleet really, so on we go. It was a pretty disappointing start with the problems with the uh, not, not going quite quick enough and then getting on the wrong side of everything, but you know, these races are typically uh, something that has happened, so uh, you have to hang in there. Um, generally, we seem to start quite slowly, get in a decent position after a couple of days, and then cough it all up then. So, we've got to try and not do that. If we go fast, we'll be all right.